Hey everybody, this is Michael Hall. It's the 1st of March, 2020, and we're here at Lake Hartwell, and I thought I'd share a really important early season cold water tip for you. So let me reach over here and grab the rod. I've only got one rod on the deck. And look at this. The Cinco Man is showing you a crankbait. In fact, uh, this happens to be a, a shad wrap. Now there's a couple of tips combined in my tip today. Okay, I, I want you all to notice that I have a loose combo here and that yes, I'm using a spinning reel. And you might ask the question, well, Mike, why are you using the spinning reel? Well, let me answer that. First of all, when it's real cold, like this morning, it was 26 degrees, your bait casting reels will make snow cones, okay? They'll collect ice. So when it's real cold in the morning, below freezing, always choose a spinning reel. Now, the second part of my tip is when you're using a light crankbait like these these shad wraps right here or shad wrap number seven is a very lightweight bait and you can throw it further with a spinning outfit okay in this particular case i've got the lose uh this is the mach 2 i think they sell these at walmart and in various places and they come as a combo but what I want you to really key in on here though is the two things I've already mentioned when it's really cold use spinning reels because they handle the cold uh, weather better and when you're throwing light crankbaits like this watch the pros they'll be using a spinning reel now let me demonstrate for you I'll keep my eye on the camera but I'll show you a cast here and this really wings it out there you know you get a so the third part of the tip when you use a light spinning rod to cast your crankbait it will throw it further a lot of times the the bait casting combos have a lot of difficulty throwing these light crankbaits so we'll demonstrate one more cast here and then we're going to be out on the lake today and and hopefully I, i'll show you a fish catch or two that we uh, come up with but anyway if you like my tips please join my youtube channel my call fishing pro hit the subscribe button you know i i got a lot of great tips out there they're fun videos a lot of the tips i don't make them too long you know they're five or six minute videos so we're trying to help everybody become a better fisherman, uh, entertain you a little bit. And what I normally try to do is, is give you a little bit of a tip and then demonstrate a fish catch with the tip that I've already discussed. So we're going to get after it. Thank goodness we finally got a decent day here in Lake Hartwell. I've been here six days and I have frozen. You know, I think for the next couple of days it's going to warm a little. The bad news is during the FLW Series tournament we've got down here this week, it's 80% of rain every day. So everybody out there, get your light crankbaits, string up some light line on your spinning rods. Don't let the cold weather stop you. Get out there and catch a big one. All right, we'll catch you later on today. Bye-bye. Here's a fish catch for you. This is a real nice Lake Hartwell spot. And we were talking about, you know, throwing the, uh, these light crankbaits. Well, here you go. Let's take a close look. Here's the shad wrap. And here's the spotted bass. Now, let's see if I can get this hook out without hooking myself. This is a nice fish. Look at the gut. He's got a he's got a putt gut almost as big as mine. But I'll take five of these in the in the tournament coming up. And everybody, uh, I appreciate you watching my videos. 
you know my call fishing pro youtube hit the subscribe button but we're going to turn this little pretty girl back and god bless america and i want to thank everybody for watching the videos and uh yeah here's a, a nice little pretty fish catch for you here she goes we're going to turn her loose give her a kiss there she goes all right everybody Get out there in the cold weather with the light crankbaits and uh, let's catch some bass. Bye-bye.